My name is Brad Hall. I'm here on the lakefront where so many joggers are out getting their jogging in. I'm gonna join them and I'm really excited about it because I've got a brand new shoe to try out, the Nike Zoom Vaporfly 4%. I'll be wearing my vlogging suit so I can take you with me on my very first run in these. I'll give you all that on the fly feedback. It's like play by play out there. So it's gonna be really exciting. And I'm really excited about this shoe. It's got so much going on in it. It's got, there it is. And it's got that Zoom X midsole, brand new foam, supposed to be very comfortable, very springy. Couple that with that full length carbon fiber plate, fly mesh upper, very lightweight. And then look at this, that's the sole and it's got that too. So let's go see if this shoe does make me 4% more efficient, 4% faster. Can't imagine what that looks like cause I'm already really fast. So here we go. Notice there's a lot of bounce here. There we go. I'm gonna try to keep her steady. Slow down a little bit. I might've been cruising too fast. Nice and easy. The Zoom X really does feel absolutely incredible. Biker passed me. That's to be expected. These shoes aren't miracle workers. You'll notice my gait pretty much perfect right now. Feeling a lot more efficient. I don't know if it's 4%, 3%, 2%, maybe even 1% more efficient, but definitely more efficient with these shoes. Technology is truly amazing. I wouldn't have been able to bring you with me on my run like this just a few years ago, but it's a good time to be alive. Haven't broken a sweat yet, that's a good sign. That could be the fly mesh. I normally get hottest on my feet. So if I keep my feet cool, the rest of my body follows. Stability is not a problem. I haven't I fallen. In, thank you. I haven't fallen in the lake yet. So, oh, lost the camera. Almost got her back up. Working out the kinks here. Excuse me. Excuse me. That is so much better. Thank you. Yep, perfect. Thank you so much. Back in action. Here we go. These cameras do have stabilization, but holding them down on my chest helps a little bit more. I've never made it this far. Shoes are really putting in the work. Oh, we got an incline. No problems going up. Now we're just at cruising speed. I feel like I'm showing off. Like the bell of the ball here. The other runners. Oh, we lost it. Thank you so much. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Okay. Probably fell down because I was running so fast in these shoes. Now let's see what it's like out on the course here. Watch me pass this guy. He's not gonna know what hits him. Look at this. Effortlessly blew by that guy. Not sure how many miles I've done yet. Probably at least a quarter. Durability is not an issue so far. The vlogging setup turning out to be not that comfortable, I'm sure. My chest and back will start bruising and develop a thicker skin. Shoes still feel good though. Just the vlogging setup is not the most comfortable. Getting out of breath. Maybe there's a water fountain coming up somewhere. Let's just see how they feel while walking. Let's see how they feel. Oh yeah, that's actually better. Feels really nice. Let's just find this tree here. Oh. And let's send some shade. Just 
just getting a little bit of shade after that run. I really put myself to work. And the shoes held up. Zoom X, it felt great. Fly mesh, barely could tell I had shoes on. That carbon fiber plate, you saw me out there. Cruising past people, no problem. <sighs> Not a bad workout today. <laughs>